My name is Abhish Mathi, but you obviously know this. You're on my channel. Uh, this is a shameless brand plug to tell you that my merchandise is out. That's right, Abhish Mathi merchandise is out. All you gotta do is go onto this website, which is whoa. Stop right there. Don't buy his merch. Buy merch by this guy. This is Akash. Akash is an intern. And now, Akash has his own merch. What the? What the? This shirt is the one and only shirt worn by Akash. Never washed, never dried, never folded by the loving hands of a mother. Who are you? And now you can get this shirt signed by this guy. This is Prakash. Prakash is from New Delhi, Delhi, India. LOL. What the f- Dude, who's doing this? Dude, I don't know what's who's happening. Who's doing this? Dude, I don't know what's happening. Oh, what, what the fuck? I don't fuck? know what's happening. What the fuck? Use the promo code, what the fuck, to get this t-shirt for 100% of the original price. Offer available till stocks last. Or Akash dies. What the fuck? Promo code applied. Here's a t-shirt. Hey, you guys can check out my merch also available now, right okay. here. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for the human version of a bumblebee, Abish Matthew! Yes, keep it going! Keep it going! Hey, how are you doing? Hi! Hi! No, 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 no! No, 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 guys, keep it going! <laughs> keep it down! Stop it! It's now time for us to meet our two guests on our thumbnail that you came to see and you had no idea about, right? Our first guest is one of India's most talented and the most popular dancers we've got. His dance choreography videos have garnered him over 1.9 million subscribers on YouTube. You might watch him as entertainment, I watch it as tutorials genuinely. Our second guest has done it all. She's been part of India's first all-girl pop band. She's a playback singer in Hindi, Telugu and Tamil films. She's an indie musician, she's a model, but one of India's biggest artists to stand up for animal rights. It gives me immense pleasure to bring on stage Melvin Lewis and Anushka Manchanda! <laughs> hey! Yo! What's happening? How are you doing? Fun. So nice to meet you guys. I've been trying to get you guys on the show and th finally you guys are here. Thank you for coming. Thank you, uh, PR team, for telling them it's another talk show and scamming them into bringing them here. No, I know about your show. I'm sure he does too. Yeah, we are course. famous here. <laughs> I just wanted to get that <laughs> for camera. Can you say it one more time with like with good emotion, like you mean it? Oh my God, I'm so excited about being on the show. It's been like on my mind for the last year and a half. I've been watching all the episodes. I think it's amazing. I'm so happy that I'm here, finally. All right. It means I've made it. Wow. Woo! <laughs> No, but honestly, yeah. can I be honest? I'm, uh, I am actually really happy to be here because I know that the show is not censored and no one is telling me what I can say and, I, and what I can't. Oh. And I really, like in this day and age, I really, really appreciate that. Wait, where, which show did you go where they asked you to censor? Like all shows? Every yeah. single show, yeah. They're yeah. like, don't bolo, don't bolo, don't bolo, don't bolo, don't bolo. It's like that, it's always yeah, like because, that. Yeah, uh, because those shows have viewers. <laughs> <laughs> so... This will be just Melvin, you, me, <laughs> and editors watching it. <laughs> so I don't think our editors are pretty chill. They usually don't file a case. Okay, I'm gonna start first with Anushka because uh, both of us have something very deep and uh, something in common. Uh, we both are from uh, Delhi. Oh, yeah. Is anyone here from Delhi? One you're from person. Delhi? One person, one People person. from Delhi, make some noise. <laughs> yeah. Delhi, I know. How does it feel to be out after 8 p.m.? It's a good, it's a great feeling. It's an amazing feeling. You're also from Delhi, and uh, by, but you were in Amity Noida, and uh, did you start with music right over there? Or were you doing something else? Like, are you one of those kids who did many things to start with? No, I mean, you know, I never. I actually went straight from school into into music. And no graduation or nothing. No, I, in fact, I didn't even end up giving my class 12th board exams because it was just before that. That like just a month before this whole contest happened. And then my teachers were like, let her go. It was that, that was it. They said, do it, give your exams through open school, just go. So are you like 12th pass or not 12th pass? So you're 11th? Yeah. 
I studied the whole year, yeah, but I'm not 12 pass. And the only time I feel bad about, I mean, I had, I was like every year for five years mm -hmm. after that, I was like, I will give my open school exam. <laughs> Until my my brother, who was like four and a half years younger than me, gave his, and then I, then I was like, fuck this, I'm not doing it. Because then I, I said, why do people study? You know, they study and they want to get a degree so that they can get a job and that they're independent and they can look after themselves. I'm already doing that. I, I feel like the only time it comes up is if I have to fill like one of those visa forms and they're like, what's your educational qualification? And I'm like, mm, I don't want to tell you. <laughs> why can't you just say, I don't believe in education? <laughs> just make a paragraph of, oh my God, she's I opinionated. I actually don't believe in the education that's currently being, you know, whatever, uh, uh, that's currently in our schools. So I would actually, you know, I would See, I second that. that. You second that? Yeah, of course I do. But you studied. <laughs> of course I studied. I was forced to study. By your parents, I'm guessing. No, then it's like an ambition, right? So you, you get enrolled in the first grade, then you want to go to the second, third, fourth, and then the benchmark is like the tenth grade. Of course, you want full pants, right? In eighth standard. <laughs> <laughs> is that the only reason you studied? <laughs> I would get to wear full pants. Of course, I wanted full pants. <laughs> and then I reach eighth standard, and my mom gives me my brother's pants. Like, you can wear this now. I'm like, what? Oh, yeah. Give me new ones. Uh, the thing that I like about Indian schools is that everybody, not a single person who's ever gone through Indian education has been like, yeah, man, I studied so much. I'm a better learner. For example, how many of you know uh, what E is equal to MC square means? You know, no? Yeah, obviously. What is C? Speed of light. What is the speed of light? <laughs> Fuck, they know. Okay, so it doesn't work. They obviously have studied. Wow. I will edit this fucking part of the show. <laughs> I am the host of the show. I got to look smart. <laughs> Wow. That's cool. There's That's some really cool. There. Yeah, Melvin. Uh, though your name is not Melvin Lewis, uh, your entire his entire name is Melvin Edward Edward George George Lewis. Melvin Edward George Lewis. Yeah. Is there a sir in the beginning? King, yeah. Lord of. <laughs> what is this great so, name? Like, did they they say whatever ancestors you remember? Grandfather, great grandfather, grandfather, sabka naam dal do. Yeah, I think uh, what happened was like I was I was doing school and then of course I was appearing for SSC and then that time there was like a form to be filled and uh, it had like a middle name thing and I did not have like a middle name that time. Mm -hmm. It was just Melvin Lewis and I was like middle name. Uh, so I asked the guy sitting on the right who was using his father's name as middle name. I was like middle name is that name is it? And then I land up writing my dad's name. So I, I land up using his name as Edward. And then his middle name was George. So then my <laughs> name now on every document is Melvin Edward George Lewis. Baki ke teen ka hai. <laughs> Melvin Edward, so your dad's name is Edward. Yeah. And George is his, his middle, middle name. I, I think uh, the best part about my name is that the word Lewis itself means king. Oh. And uh, yeah, and, and Melvin means reliable friend. See, Aww. so it becomes very easy when you're talking to girls and all. You know, what does your name mean? I am King Reliable Friend. <laughs> <laughs> the Reliable King. See, son of a beast, where we also give education with entertainment, <laughs> talking about education. You studied in Bombay, though. Yeah, yeah. You've been a Bombay, born and raised. Of course. You've not moved out. You've stayed in yeah, Bombay. Stayed here. Which part of Bombay? Uh, so I grew up at this place called Sion. Sion is like the starting of South Bombay. Oh, yeah, that's your claim to fame. No, of course it is, yeah? <laughs> Sign is where the rickshaws end and the taxis begin. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> great. Of course, we have this crazy junction over there. So you get down on the right side of the road, all the rickshaws end there. There's like a long queue. And mm. then there's like cabs on the opposite side. You cross the road, mm. you're posh. It's the pele to Melwin, eh? Melwin. Then you're suddenly <laughs> King Reliable. <laughs> Taxi! To <laughs> Jaiga, <laughs> South Bombay. <laughs> Suddenly you get an accent. You're like, hey, kya bolta hai? Hey, maare ka tere ka is zaudi hai. Hello, you motherfucker. It's literally that transition. I love it. I didn't. I, I knew the thing, the same thing for ba uh, Mahim, but I don't know. Sayan had the same yeah, thing. Yeah, Sayan has the same thing. It's it's crazy. Like I used to like come back. Um, so I didn't know for a very long time that uh, this is the point where you actually get off rickshaws. So once I actually took a rickshaw guy right ahead, right up till Matunga, till a traffic cop stopped us. Like, hey, kute chal hai tu. <laughs> and then we got off. And uh, to my surprise, I was like, I didn't know about it. And I was like, Isko hai, why did he get me here? And then poor thing got fined and stuff like that. Yeah. You're, yeah, you're we a terrible the person. We reached King Circle. There's something called as King Circle right in the middle of Matuga and Sain. Yeah. So yeah. you managed to reach King Circle. That's your circle? <laughs> That's, <laughs> That's where you usually are from. It's like, do you go there and like, yes, I own this place. I, I am the king of Sain. <laughs> Uh, you also played basketball. Did you any play any sports, Anushka, yeah. back in school? I played 
uh, a little bit of state handball. State handball. Yeah, and then I, I remember going for one match and uh, they made a UP team because Noida comes under UP. Don't and have to tell them that. <laughs> I just told them I'm from Delhi. <laughs> <laughs> and and so they had like there were two students from my school and the mm. rest were all from different parts of UP. But that was my only experience. I have I have been called chudel. My mm. hair has been pulled. I have been called. I don't want to say, but it's really like I've really been called some choice uh, wow, Hindi words. Wow, you're censoring words. yourself. I suddenly feel like Should you I think not people censor? are they gonna could, watch this. They're looking very young, yar. No, guys, can everyone say, guys, we just need to break the ice open, okay? So, we're gonna start with normal abuse so that you... Can everyone say Sala. Sala. Sala's fine. Sala's, Sala's good. Sala's good. Let's bring it up. The one which has a lot of stop consonants, which is one of my favorite. I don't know what it means, but it is so good. Bhosidi wale. <laughs> but you gotta say it like you are from Ullasnagar. <laughs> bring out your Sarita Vihar and say Bhosidi wale, okay? One, two, three. Oh, oh, that bass, dude! Nuclear called. He wants that bass back. Bass. <laughs> so yes, Chudel is okay. <laughs> if that's your concern. What called? Bhain ki lodi. Oh, oh, bhain, bhain ki lodi is good. Bhain ki lodi. It's such a, it's such a Delhi thing. The, the, the thing is, people in Bombay don't. What does it mean, though? <laughs> what does it mean? What does it mean? Okay, I'll tell you what I thought. You know, Bhain ki lodi means. Okay. Oh no, I no. For me, it's Bengal order. Sorry, I'm not. <laughs> sorry, yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry. I'm a, I'm a guy. Okay, so I thought, okay, because there's the word bhen in it, hmm. and then loda in it. Hmm. Isn't loda? Uh, big? Constructor, yeah. The builders. Sorry, <laughs> 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 me. I thought. So I thought uh, you are your sister's penis. That's what I thought. And I was just like, no, she doesn't have, so I was never offended. <laughs> I was just like, bro, I was like, bio nahi aata. <laughs> Jokes on you. But you used to play basketball yeah. for state. Uh, yeah, I, I used to be captain of Mumbai and Ooh. stuff like that. Yeah. Ah, like, girls see? listening, girls listening. See, but you were going blah, 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 blah. And Melvin's like, mm. you know, the only reason I like, I think that most of the guys get into basketball is because like, they always dribble with like a pout. Yeah, it was all because of kuch kuch hota Yeah. Is that why you got into basketball? <laughs> because kuch kuch hota hai, not Michael Jordan. <laughs> kuch kuch hota hai inspired you to not become me. a basketball player. The rest player. of the team was kuch kuch hota hai. Oh, okay. And then that's why I got to shine a lot more because then I was very inspired by Michael Jordan, of course. Yeah. And I still use my tongue like, you know, when I'm dancing also my tongue comes out just the way Jordan does it when he's dribbling and going for a layup shot. I don't know, what, the, what does that look like? So it looks like... So the word that that's actually called focus face. Focus. Face. Everybody has something called focus face. Like it's also your focus face and your orgasm face <laughs> are supposed to be the same. Really? Are you like? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Fair enough. Wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying to bring out a memory. Yeah. It's actually the same. Do I? No, I don't think so. I, I'll figure it out. I'm going to pay attention next time. Uh, Anushka, I want to talk to you uh, about when you moved to Bombay. Uh, before you moved to Bombay, you guys were planning on going to the United States of America. The entire yes. family was supposed to shift, but you met with an accident. Yes. Uh, sure. Because of which, family cancelled the plan. Yeah. And you, your family allowed you to not give your 12th board. So I was bitten by my dog. And then once it happened, I had like 200 stitches here. You got bit by your own dog? Yes, it was not his fault, yaar. That's what... Why? You kept food here. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just going to tell uh, Avish's favorite part of the story. This happened in the middle of the night. And I, I, I was like, oh my god, you know? And I, I was, and I went to the bathroom and put the light on and I screamed because I saw my lip like hanging loose like that. Which brought my mother running into the room and she saw me and she started screaming, which woke my younger brother up and he woke up and he saw me and he shat his pants. Literally. This is a... This he is a... actually shat his pants. <laughs> so uh, sad. So I know it's really sad and all of that <laughs> so and sad. America didn't happen and you came to Bombay, life was yeah, great. Yeah, yeah. But he shat his pants. <laughs> <laughs> but... Oh, no. <laughs> Did you go like, ah, 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 <laughs> this is okay, are you okay? Like, ah. oh my. Uh, but question to you is that, is it after that incident that your love for animals that went ahead or were you always about the protection for animals right at that age? Or did it come at a much later stage in life? 
No, I've always been like, you know, I always had love for animals. We always had like dogs in the house while we were growing yeah. up. So it was really normal. But it it's just that as I as I got older and I, uh, you know, I started paying attention to what was happening around me, I just felt it more and more. And then, you know, as time passed, I realized how many, because I always said, I love animals. And I mm. didn't even realize that I was doing things that, mm. was, that was causing pain and suffering to these very animals. I didn't say, I love animals, but it's okay, I'm eating them. That's okay, I'm using, you know, products on my face which have been tested on them, but I love animals. So, it's only when you find out about these things, like I found out about these things and I was like, oh my god, what? No, not me, I, you know, and so it was, it was much later. Yeah. So, it I, wasn't because particularly of no, Toto no, no, or no. anything? Yeah. All right, and you, you're a huge fan of animals or you're, you just like... I like them, I like them, I like them. <laughs> <laughs> you're good. I like, I I like them. Uh, but before that, when you moved to, uh, you moved to Bombay because of Viva. Yes. And uh, this is an audition phase in reality TV. And you auditioned for it and your parents said, no, we don't approve of it. Or your dad approved of it, but your mom didn't. I just wanted to get out of studying and that's the only reason I wanted to go. And then I went there and like my whole life changed after that. Were you a singer before that? You know, I was playing some piano and a little bit of singing, but I wasn't really singing. Everyone in my family was like, hai? Like, they felt all very, uh, they were like, Hame to bataya nahi kisi ne, you, know? <laughs> <laughs> you just went for the audition round. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'll just go. It's a good experience and everything. I had the other stuff like when, you know, like anyone would come home, there was, we would, we were always, yeah, Acha, kuch karke dikhao. You know, hmm. that, you hmm. know how parents are, everyone does it. So at first it was like, piano pe kuch baja ke dikhao. Then hmm. that got a bit boring. And so they started dance karke dikha and there was, we had this, you know, I used to dance to Ye Kali Kali Aankhe from Bazigar. And uh, it went on, this went on for, I would say like about two years mm -hmm. before I had one experience after which I, after which I was able to tell my parents, fuck you if you make me do this in front of anyone else. Because they made me perform this dance in front of an uncle who had come to visit after lunch. And while I was dancing, he fell asleep. <laughs> and, <laughs> yeah, and I was like, <laughs> 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 I was like, that you were like, where is your kali kali aake? Why can I see eyes over it? <laughs> he slept like, off. He slept, yeah, and I was like, told my parents, I was like, you ever make me do this shit again in front of any? Look at that. <laughs> how, you know how this feels? <laughs> as an artist, <laughs> I'm a kid. As an artist, I'm offended. That's when it stopped. So you realized. actually used to dance. Your parents didn't know you used to sing. But for you, you were like, uh, you the, yeah, yeah. basketball hmm. and then directly dance. So basically you said, what are the professions and art forms <laughs> where everyone will think I'm cool? I was actually always dancing as a kid also. Like, you know, we had like good songs back then, like Coco, Jumbo and stuff like that. So we yeah. were always doing the wave and trying different things. You started dancing yeah. uh, at a very young age. Yeah, I started dancing young, I think playing and basically it was everything about like, you know, whatever gets the attention of the girls and all like. So then it was like, you know, so I made like uh, a strategy and I, I told myself that, listen, <laughs> so uh, our school had only one sport, which was basketball. So mm -hmm. I said, okay. And teachers, they had only one thing to do on stage, dance. Dancing. Mm -hmm. so I said, the only way of getting noticed now in life is to learn how to dance and how to play ball. Wow. So then I really seriously worked very hard and all and tanned in the process and stuff like that. Then you went to the national television uh, for the first time. Yeah. And you, uh, were, which dance competition did you apply for for the first time? So this was And actually... you didn't get through. So your uncle moment happened to him on yeah. television. Yeah. It was a very bizarre incident actually. Very cute one also. Because I got a lot of sympathy after that. Uh, so I was on national television auditioning for this uh, show called uh, Dance India Dance Season 2. Okay? Mm -hmm. So you have all the legends and the guru sitting. There's Mitunda sitting and stuff like that. We were made to audition. There was this round uh, called Top 36. Uh -huh. Where uh, our mega rounds were going on. And of course, like, you know, it's like a clutter of people and talent. And of course, you're, it's like a very nail-biting situation. Everybody's like, you know, very competitive and stuff like that. So I was auditioned last and in the meanwhile, I had to sit like y'all in the audience, mm. all right? So I was sitting in the audience right from 7 in the morning mm. and of course, out of nervousness, I did not eat all day. It was like, mera kab hai, mera kab hai. And they did not tell me when it is, right? So they would just call you like, you know, yeah, I know auditions are like, auditions those days at least were like very hectic process. And then I land up going on stage, auditioning, everything is fine, now results, right? So of course, now I've auditioned. Yeah. But then results. So there was a gap of around uh, uh, half an hour. Again, I didn't eat nothing. 
and then I'm on stage. Like, you know, the whole drama section of like two people standing and then, you know, they'll tell you whether you're selected or no, or who's selected or both are selected or both are rejected. <laughs> so that moment. And then there were these lights, right? So all four of them starting to blur in my eyes. So th like, I, th this is the light focus. It's just going like... And I was like, Sura Jaya, Sura Jaya, Sura Jaya, Sura Jaya. <laughs> really? I, 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 I was losing focus, I think. And then I was telling myself, listen, just announce the results and all. In the meanwhile, the judges were giving the build up, of course. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, they were talking about, Melvin, you were like, na, 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 na. And I'm like, jaldi bola, jaldi bola, jaldi bola, jaldi bola. <laughs> <laughs> and in the meanwhile, the production people, I think, spotted that mm. this guy is going to pass up. Because I wobbled. And then, uh, of course, to my horror or whatever you want to call, um, uh, they did not take me. They took the other guy. Mm. And I was like, chalo, ho gaya na, bhi chalo, jate. Mm. And then Mithunda got up and he said, Melvin, he wanted to hug me. And I, I can't walk. <laughs> I couldn't walk. So I managed, okay. So I take two steps and all, and then I stumble. And they were like, ab to girega, ab to girega, ab to girega. <laughs> and then I further take five more steps and I found him. And he murmured something in my ears, which mm. I don't know what he said. And I said, okay, okay, okay. And then I was just moving and then Remo said, Melvin. <laughs> So I hug Revo and then I hug the other judges. By the time I reach the third judge, mm. I wake up and all I see is like the audience in Leather City. <laughs> and I was like, hey, something is not right you here. You passed out. I passed out. You fainted. I fainted. I, I feel fainted, bad yeah. for the other judges because the third judge is like uh, under pressure. Was third judge must be sitting. Achha, Mithuda ne hug kar diya. Achha. Revo ne bhi hug kar diya. Chal, main bhi bolte tha hug karne ke liye aaja. And then you faint. <laughs> It's like the biggest like high five left remaining. It was, like, very embarrassing. it was very embarrassing because I woke up like that and everybody was like... <laughs> and I was like, what? My hair is wrong? <laughs> and then I turn around and I have all the judges standing on my face like fanning me and all like get up, get up and all. And then I woke up huh? and then I was like gone. They're going to show it. And it Did actually... It? Yeah, of course. It Did, was a trailer. Of course they Are you it. serious? Yeah. Did they add the jijiks? Yeah, it happened, it happened, yeah. It Red flash yeah. is coming. They like designed everything and whatever. Whatever. Look at Melvin, he's so happy, he was so cool, 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 fainted. <laughs> Even after all of that, they didn't put you in the show. <laughs> they didn't put me in the show. I mean, usually reality television needs, you know, bad, sad story yeah. and like, you know, my Drama. struggle. You showed the struggle there. Yeah. <laughs> he fainted. It was more embarrassing when I was watching the episode back at home with my <laughs> people and all. Sachi me bevo shua kya? Yeah, script me Yeah, yeah. Like they told you to faint or what? I was like, what do you mean? I really passed out. Like, no, they would not believe it. Now, before we go on to the games, I want to just quickly talk about the project that you are doing. Uh, you started off with Mera Desh Mera Base campaign, where you went across the country, but because nobody was coming, you changed it to Melvin Lewis tour. Uh, <laughs> then you're like, yeah, ye hipster hipster wali baate nahi chal rahi hai, yaar. I have to do it. And now, when are you doing your next one? Uh, uh, my next one is happening on the 26th, 27th. Of? Um, January. Oh, ja so that just happened, you mean? Happened. Just just happened. This episode is in February, right? Oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, so when is... Uh, this is... We're in, we're in the future right now. <laughs> you are watching it live at 8 p.m. on a Friday, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully it's 8 p.m., hopefully it's Friday. But in February, when is it happening? <laughs> Yes. Which means now. So it was fun, like, you know, I just finished one on the 26th and 27th. Of oh, January. how was that? <laughs> It was at I am Ahmedabad. It was really fun. Oh, okay. And then, of course, like I'm traveling to Chandigarh on the 9th and 10th of Feb. Oh, nice. 9th and 10th of Feb. I'm sure this episode is out by then. <laughs> <laughs> Bapa Arishka, you've, you've got an uh, alternative, uh, uh, alternative identity called Nuka, which is N U K A. Sanushka Manchanda being, uh, which comes with like a huge name of being uh, seen on television and being seen on stage for so long. You realize that there's another way you want to put across your opinions and uh, yes. uh, everything about animal rights. For that, you've created an account called Nuka. Nuka. What all the Nuka? Not yeah. Nuka. <laughs> Not like. Ooh, Ooh. <laughs> I wish I could do that. It's the fact that I wanted to do uh, something which was completely under my control. Because when you're working with other people, then you don't have so much control over the creatives, you know. And then you also end up, like I've been doing this for so many years that I've done a lot of shit also. Like a Telugu song that you sang? My Tamil song? Tamil song, yeah. But it was nice, yeah. It was just uh, raunchy, that's all. It's a raunchy song. It's a raunchy but song. why do they go to you for raunchy songs? Like. Well, people come to me for a lot of raunchy stuff. I've done all the voiceovers for the Man Force condom ads and... Uh, what is their tagline? <laughs> what is that? Man... I, 
I'm sorry, it's just on a name basis, I'm against that condom. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I get to use it much, but. <laughs> But you got a raspy voice, that's because of it. Yeah, so you want to keep your raspy identity for like, you know, raspy songs and for Anushka Yeah, I want to keep that, I, you know, when we were talking earlier, you said something, uh, you said the kitchen and something for the kitchen and something for the one soul. One for the kitchen, one for the soul. One for the kitchen, one for the soul. So this is for the kitchen. Mm -hmm. And for the soul is really all the stuff that I feel strongly about, like the environment, like the, like animal welfare and just, you know, human rights, whatever it is, like, and that stuff I want to do through my art with complete control without some idiot standing over me who doesn't know anything about it, creativity telling me what to do. Yeah. So it's basically, it's basically for that. Well, thank you so much, both of you, for coming. I've got, uh, I'm, I've got some things for you. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start off with uh, Anushka. We've got for you, uh, I think these are vegan products. Oh. Uh, <laughs> literally, <laughs> they were like, sweet. what can we get? We, we decided on getting a lot of things. We're like, oh no, that, I won't, that's not vegan. Okay, great. How about this? Oh no, that is it animal? No, wait. The <laughs> amount of go if you look at our Google, uh, what all we've Googled about these products, we're like, yeah, this seems to be all right. So this I, is I really, for you. I really appreciate that. And I know I because really you're vegan, there are very few products out in the world. I really appreciate so this is a month-long supply we've got for you. Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. And for Melvin, yes. uh, Melvin, uh, it might be small in size, but it's how you use it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I like small things, you're the best one. Uh, I would like you to open it up, it's, uh, it's a ribbon. <laughs> you want to open it? Yeah, go for it. It's a stamp we got for you. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, with a stamp that reads. It reads Melvin Edward George <laughs> Lewis. <laughs> so that next time when you go, you can stamp your rightful heir, the king of the north of Zion. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. All right, it's time for us to play the games. Let's go. And now, for a good reason, climate change. Hi, my name is Abhish Pathew. I'm a comedian, I'm a writer, I'm a motivational speaker, I'm an activist, and more importantly, a believer that Mother Nature needs to be saved. Did you know that some scientists believe that we are living through the sixth mass extinction? In the previous five, 75% of species have died away. So when you, are looking at your luxurious products, I want you to really think about it. That one extra minute of hot shower, is that required? When you apply deodorant with that aerosol going up into the air, is that required? Would you much rather Mother Nature die or would you rather die? Obviously. This is me, Abhish Matthew. You know what to do. All right. Woo! It's time for us to play a game called Senseless Games. To play this game, we need a fourth player because I think three of us won't just cut it. So ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for a very close friend of mine, also a person who's been writing this show for the last three seasons. So East India Comedy or every other comedy industry, if you're looking, he's available to write. Please make some noise for Mr. Saurav Mehta! <laughs> Very funny. Hi. Hi. Is it Saurav? Saurav. Sort of, sort of, sort of. I like the color combination you've That's got. That's right. I feel very basic though. Yeah, you, this is a biker gang. Yeah. Biker gang. I am Sales gully gang. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Both hard. Both. <laughs> <laughs> it's, nice. Never mind. Okay. All right. Now this game consists of a couple of rounds. Uh, in this round, a player is given an impairment. Right now, it could be either in this in this in this round, you could either be. Uh, or not using your visual senses, or in the other round where you'll be losing your auditory senses, uh, you would be losing out a sense on its own. And then the other player, whoever is the one with the, with the impairment, will have to draw depending upon what this person tells you. So it's lip reading or the other. At the end of each round, the audience gets to decide which team's drawing is the closest to the original, and that team will win. So let's start. The first round. So images, for example, if you're confused, what it'll be like. So example, if it's, I don't know why the sponsor plugs keep coming in. Uh, why did you put Cadbury Five Star, the sponsor of season five as an image? You know I'm not about brand plugs like this, okay? I'm all about integrity. I'll throw it, but they're giving money. So just put it nicely here. All right, so images such as, okay, very funny. <laughs> Very funny. Just because five stars said we need 15 seconds of screen time doesn't mean you got to put 
two images of five star and we are only at 10 seconds. Next one is also five star, great. This is a bigger five star. The bigger five star and this deserves, oh, like this? Like, am, I, am I doing it right? Also, okay, it's great. softer this time. Oh, yeah, it's softer. Five star, it's bigger and softer. So now, before we start this game, so we need to divide mm. the team. I just have an idea. Yeah. He's Cyan. Yeah. I'm Mahim. Oh, dude, you guys are together. Okay. I was thinking we should figure out who's better, Cyan or Mahim. Oh. <laughs> no, uh, I think clearly uh, Mahim. Cyan. All right, so I'm going to divide the team. I want uh, both of you guys with uh, really low rental rates to be together. All right. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. I'm sorry. Low okay. rental rates, but low crime rates. Someone from Noida should know that. Oh! <laughs> Yeah. You know, as as I, I feel like as two Delhiites, I mean Delhi and that Noida person, <laughs> you and I should be in the same team. I get Melvin and Saurabh are okay. gonna be in the same team. Got it. You, what would you like to call your team? Can we discuss it? Oh yeah, sure, man. We can discuss yeah. it. Saurabh will call me something. I, I'll come and discuss it. I think it. I think we should uh, I think we should call ourselves uh, don't, fuck no with <laughs> don't fuck with us. Don't, don't, don't fuck, fuck with us. Don't fuck with us. Okay, we fuck with everyone. Yeah. D. <laughs> All right. We got it. Don't fuck with us versus we fuck with everyone. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yes. Don't fuck with us versus we fuck with everyone. I'm gonna get me blindfolded. Okay. Uh, you now what you need to do is you need to show everyone the image hmm. and then use the image as a reference and guide me through it while I keep drawing okay. and then we'll see if the image is the closest or not. <clears throat> get everything. Hey, I'm a professional. <laughs> Okay. You think I don't know how to do this? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Holy shit. Uh, oh, holy shit. Okay. No, Where wait, is it no, wait, no, wait, no, wait, wait, wait. Whoa. <laughs> Guys, nothing woven. Tell no. Okay, one Time second. is running one out. Sec one second. In the center, just make Saturn, the planet. Oh, okay. Like, make, make a circle and then make some, like, two rings around it. And make right next to that another side. Don't go too big. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Keep it the size of a small chapati. And one. Where, 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 where? Okay, so on the left side, lower. Uh, <laughs> make. No, not all the way there, yeah. Okay, ha, ha, tell no. Make Ch another Saturn. Make huh? another Saturn. Another one with a ring around it. Ha, I put three, now, three rings. The, each. <laughs> in the corner of this, on the left bottom corner. That's where I was. A, make a half, like a sun. Make a sun coming out of the corner. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I got it. It's and like makes, a children's school book some, types. And make some rays, okay? Huh? Say so rays, I put it. Sun may raise okay, it. Okay, okay. And above that, make another ball which is blue. How do I now make, how will you make it blue? Just make a blue ball. And then above that, make another ball on the left hand. <laughs> above that? If add you your time. All right, time's up. If oh. you made a testicle, I will. Did you make a testicle? No, no. Okay. Uh, I would want you to bring the image and place it right next to this so that I can see my beautiful work of art. Three, two, one. Hey! Hey, whoa, wow! It's not bad, huh? Not bad, dude. This is, okay, I got this part correct. You got this guy also. I got this guy also. You got this guy. And this is very smart. I just, I want to shake. Shake hands. Say, thank you. I didn't. I wouldn't have thought of that. It's excellent. This is blue. It's blue. Yes. Uh, so guys, as you can see, uh, how much do you think you'll rate it from one to three? Three being uh, the least. One, sorry, three being the most and one being the least. On one, two, and three. Two. Two point five. Yeah. One point five. One point five. <laughs> I think it's just that they don't like the way from Delhi or some shit, maybe. So wait, 1.5? Yeah. Okay, let's see if these what? guys can do better. We were talking about 2.5. Oh, 2. And you all have come to 1. 2 or 2.8? 2. 2. 2. <laughs> 2. Done. Melvin, I have an idea. Before we start, just keep dancing also while drawing, okay? <laughs> Give us extra points for that, okay, guys? Okay? Yes. That's right. Okay, Melvin, yes. Oh. Yes. All right. Even I'll talk while explaining. Okay. All right. <laughs> cool. All right. So we... your time starts now. Oh. Okay. Uh, so on the left hand side, there's a tree. Okay. Just draw a big tree on the entire left hand side. There's a bark. Okay. Going on on the left hand side. I, I, I can see what he's drawing. No. No. You. Oh can't. man. Okay. Just draw a full <laughs> bark, and on top there are like leaves and you know whatever. You know how in KG. How big is your tree? 
Uh, it's big, it's the full left side as such, okay? Uh, no, more or less, okay? Now, it's okay. Uh, now, on the right hand side, right top. Are there birds on it? Just twerk, just twerk. <laughs> on the right hand side, yes. On the right hand side, on top, there are two houses, like two huts, okay? Um, all right. Two huts, two huts. Wow, your yeah, huts now are... in the middle, now in the middle, just draw a girl who's blindfolded. What profile? Left profile, right uh, profile? Uh, said... It's just full profile. Full profile. She's got a hand spread. She's trying to be Shah Rukh Khan. Okay. okay. This is representing India. Uh, on her right hand side, there's a there's a boy hmm. wearing and shorts. Three. There's a boy? There's Two. a boy wearing shorts. Man. On her right hand side. All right, pants down! Pants down! Pants down! Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, come here, come here. Oh Mabu, my God. would you like to look at your work of art? Please raise your hand. It's not bad. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Uh, I have I have to There ask. was a girl here also. Yeah, yeah, but I was just trying to get the main like most outside. Guys, I just like to tell you that according to Melvin. You should just told me people are playing blind man's buff. I would have drawn it. Just a question. Is this a girl? Or a lampshade? <laughs> and uh, uh, is this swipe up to subscribe? Because this is <laughs> this is not a hut. This is a hut. Oh, this is a boy. I, I, <laughs> you know, boys have more than knees also. Thanks, Sora. Yeah. <laughs> On the scale of See, one it, to three. Two point one at least. How three? Three. They said three. They said three. Three. They said three. Look at the size, yeah. Look at the size. They said three. three. Yeah. Democracy. Look, look at democracy. The, okay. They said three. See, Obviously. I got three things out of five, right? Yeah, that's right. I got three things right out of five. So I got the tree right. I got the two huts also. Achha, achha, ghar jao abhi, chalo. Right? <laughs> yeah. Chalo, chalo, chalo. This is three. How is this possible? This is How not is this three. Possible? Three. So we won, yes. right? Yes. Okay. First round. Yes. yes. First round. Yes. Woo! W. What is the team name? Oh, we fuck with everyone. Anushka, can you hear me? Anushka. Okay. Anushka. Anushka, can you hear me? Can you hear me? No way. <laughs> Okay, we need to play the game, okay? Oh my god, I really can't hear okay, you. Okay, good, good. We, I, I'm going to say you are going to draw. Yeah, okay. okay. Now, look there. I good. see there? Yeah, f uh, 10 seconds. Look, I have to show this to oh, them. Oh. Okay, time starts now. Oh. Okay, Anushka, turn back. Anushka, turn back. Anushka, turn back. Oh, yeah, good, okay. All right, oh, fuck you, man. <laughs> Uh, you can act it out also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, uh, in the bottom, uh, uh, in the center, <laughs> right in, center. right center, center, center. In center. center. Uh, do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah, guys shooting, guys shooting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Four guys four shooting, guys shooting. In the center. Yeah, four center shooting, shooting. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Wait, wait, one second, one second. I only made one guy to make four guys. No, no, just stick. Yeah, they fucking put a pant on. Put sticks. <laughs> Put sticks. Wait one second. Stick, Wait. stick, drawing, stick. Head, single straight. Gun. One leg, one leg. One hand, one hand. Gun. Gun like this. Okay, got it. Okay. Wait. Now, wait, listen. There is a tree. <laughs> tree. <laughs> tree. <laughs> what am I? Oh. A tree. <laughs> I take a seed, I put it, I water it. <laughs> what is that? Oh, Tree. You're, you're putting some seed, water, <laughs> and a plant. Yeah, tree, yeah, plant, a big plant. plant. Behind big, them. Big, yeah, behind the big plant. Are you talking like an explosion behind them or something? No, yeah, plant. tree, tree, plant. yeah, yeah, explosion, but not tree like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now there is a in the in the oh fuck, time's up. Time's up. <laughs> okay, time. Time's up. That's it. Time's up. Anushka, time's up. Anushka, 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 Anushka. Hello. 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 Time's up. Hello. Hello. Oh my God. Time's up. Time's up. Time's up. Okay. All right, got it. Guys, this is out of three. Dude, come on, man. Interpretive dancing. I, I was saying tree. What is this and throwing putting water? You it's a seed, I'm putting water, it's becoming a big tree. <laughs> like I'm saying tree, tree. But this is very close, guys, out of one, two, three. 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 three, thank you. Oh. Three it is.
look there, look there, okay? Stay. Oh. Holy fuck. <laughs> it's bad or what? It's very bad. Oh, turn, turn. No, no, no. Oh, sorry. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Okay, ready. Ready, ready, ready. Ready, okay. okay. And your time left starts now. Okay. Draw a bullock cart. Bull, bull. Yeah. Two bulls. Two bulls. Yeah. Bulls. Yeah. <laughs> Bulls. Yeah, oh shit, how are bulls? Cows, actually, it's cows. Listen. <laughs> what the, what it's actually you? cows, okay? Listen. <laughs> Not yeah. bulls? Yeah, bulls, bulls. They're bulls yeah. with yeah. horns, yeah, yeah, horns. Yeah. And there's somebody sitting on top. And someone's sitting on Oh, okay, okay. It's someone sitting Okay, this is. <laughs> what the fuck? Quickly. He, he's. Yes, yes. Okay, okay, got okay, that. I got it. <laughs> yeah. He has a shade also. What? Okay, forget it. There are three hearts here. Here, here on the yeah, corner. Upper. Upper, middle. Ha, three hearts, three hearts. Hearts. Three hearts. houses, houses. Okay, okay. That I got. Yeah, three. <laughs> yeah, that's a house, not an arrow. Yeah. Hut. Three hearts. Oh, okay, okay, wait. Three, three. Three. Yes. And put one, one second, tree in the middle. windows. Yes. How, sorry, how, yeah, okay, done. Put one tree in the middle of the three so, huts. What? Three huts? Three, three huts. Uh, yes, yeah. one, three. No, one. Yeah, one Two. going up. Three. Three. One, three. Stop. Clouds. Stop. Three, three, three. Stop. Stop. Three. Stop. Three. Stop. 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 Anushka, I can't Stop. see. Stop. I can't Stop. see. Stop. Anushka. Stop. I can't see. Stop. I, I Stop. can't Stop. see. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, you guys get to decide. All right. How bad is it, guys? Oh, wow. Really? <laughs> See, guys. All right. Guys. Oh, a bullet cart. Yeah. Oh. I thought a bullet and Abish is on top just going like this. <laughs> I would just like yeah, to tell that. you, um, that could be Abish, but why am I riding a rabbit? <laughs> Listen, I don't fat shape, okay? Oh. Yeah, oh it's good, God. I think. Yeah. It's really good. All one, right. two, three, one, two, three, one, bullock cart, trees. Yeah, yeah, we won. We won. We got the main stuff. We got no, the no, main no, no, stuff, no, no. right? You get to decide. Yeah. What do you think the score? Four. To be honest. Two, two, four. Three, two, three. From three. Four, four. Two. Guys, two. Come on, guys. Come on. Okay, I'll two. tell you what. 2.6. Hey, fuck off. They said two. 2.6. <laughs> two. Come on. Two. Two. Hey, two, hey. two, two. 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 Extra two points. Who's giving it? Point two. Half two point two. One more now. So you're Guys, a two. so much. We oh. lost because of that cow. What was your first two? That's a rabbit. You see what you're doing? Creating animosity between us. <laughs> what was your first call? Uh, Four. And fuck off. We got three. 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 Yeah, three. 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 Yes. Plus two. two. Five. Five. Okay. Uh, what was our first score? Two. What was our second score? Three. Oh, also five. Two. Oh, tiebreaker. So Purposely guys, did it. Uh, so that only means that the winner for tonight is. Oh, one second. <laughs> I forgot. Uh, the winner, I, I was cheating a little bit. I've got to hear it from the Aeneas. Uh, the winner for tonight's game, uh, if you have to go fair and square, is uh, team uh, I don't give a fuck. We fuck with everyone. We group fuck with everyone. Yes! I'm sorry, it's just... Bombay wins the... again. I'm sorry. Yes, yes. It's just... <laughs> it's just... We got that. Oh. We got that. I, would, I, I, I am not trying to break won. your heart at this. We won. They did. We won. That's true. Mm -hmm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, once again, please make some noise. Anushka Manchanda and Melvin Lewis. Please keep it going to Sarah's match, but don't go anywhere. We got Sarah with these picks coming up. Bye. And now, for no reason at all, green things on green screen. Kale and spinach are great for your health on a daily basis. <laughs> We've got an extremely talented singer-songwriter on Son of a Beast Picks tonight. His new singles, Mayor Thum and Yadon Ki Bandarga came out in 2018 and has performed at the Vans New Wave Festival and the NH7 Weekender. Tonight, he'll be performing in collaboration with Ramya Pathuri, a new song called Stranger. Ladies and gentlemen, we give you Rono! <laughs> On the 
this carousel with no end in sight.
hey, you see till the end. This is like a post credit scene. I only got 20 seconds to tell you this, but I know you're watching the episode, but you're not subscribing. So why don't you just click that subscribe button? Be a friend. Check out the rest of the episodes that we've got on Son of a Beast. Also, you can get this cup on golouter.in. That's my merchandise and stuff. I'm cool now. <laughs>